Numner 1.2004 Toyota Camry. Selling price, $800. The Toyota Camry is well known for its longevity, and this 16-year-old example looks like it still has plenty of life left in it. That said, the ad only includes one exterior photo, and none of the interior. The seller does say there are no rips in the seats, and goes on to list all the features this SEV6 includes. The seller also mentions that the car starts every time and has no flaws at all. There is no mention of how many miles it has racked up over the years, which probably means a lot. Number 2. 2000 Honda CRV. Selling price, $900. Another solidly reliable choice, lots of older Honda CR verses can still be found scooting along the highways and byways. This one is from an era when utility won out over style, and has a surprisingly spacious rear seat and cargo area for its diminutive size. The gold color means it is a relatively rare SE trim, for all you CRV collectors. The ad doesn't mention the rarity, but it does say this CRV is equipped with optional all wheel drive. Its 147,000 miles aren't all that much for its age, but just as important as how well it's been cared for and its overall condition, both serious factors to consider when buying any used vehicle. Number 3. 2003 Ford Taurus. Selling price, $700. Ford built a whole lot of examples of the Taurus during the latter part of the 20th century, a surprising number of which are still on the road today. Large production numbers also mean parts should remain readily available for a while yet, and that's always a good thing with a used car. Among its other virtues, this one lists a new battery, front struts, and the claim that it is driven daily. Perhaps most significantly, the ad also says it's not due for another inspection until February 2021, and includes a photo to prove it. Number 4. 2001 Volvo S80. Selling price, $950. Newer Volvos may not have the bulletproof reputation of models from the 1960s and 70s. The most famous of these older Volvos is a P1800 that traveled some 3 million miles and into the Guinness Book of World Records in the hands of owner Irv Gordon. That said, newer models make for more comfortable and spacious cruising, such as this Volvo S80 with 213,000 miles and counting. The owner says it isn't pretty, but it gets to neighboring New Hampshire and back. According to Google, that's a minimum of 84 miles from the town listed in the ad. Number 5. 2001 Honda Civic Selling Price, $750. Said to run great, this Civic Coupe in LX trim still looks a little rough around the edges. Thoughtful application of body color duct tape helps, and is easily removable for a more thorough inspection. With 229,000 miles, it has been around the block more than a couple of times, and the ad says it does need a new brake line. But once that's taken care of, this Civic Coupe could make a good and fuel-efficient commuter car or urban transport, without the worry of adding a few more scratches. Just consider having some extra duct tape on hand. Number 6. 2005 Subaru Outback. Selling price, $800. With all-wheel drive, room for five passengers, and a decent amount of cargo room, the Subaru Outback is a popular choice combining the virtues of a wagon and an SUV. Outbacks also tend to hold their value, making this one look like a potentially good deal. The ad claims the cars runs well, but rather ominously says it needs a thorough interior cleaning, perhaps part of the reason for the low price. Still, removing grime is a problem nearly any potential buyer can address either with a professional cleaning or by doing it yourself to save a few bucks. The noisy rear wheel bearing could be another story, making a pre-purchase inspection by a mechanic an especially good idea. Number 7. 2004 Volkswagen Passat. Selling price, $850. A spacious and upscale wagon when new, this Volkswagen Passat looks to be in relatively good shape for its age or, at least that much can be said for the one side visible in the ad. The owner does say the Passat comes with all service records, has new tires, and that the timing belt has been replaced. The fact that the owner has even kept records and performed scheduled maintenance could be a sign the car has been well cared for. As a bonus, those new tires are likely worth at least half the asking price. There's no mention of mileage, but this one could be worth a look. Number 8. 2007 Nissan Altima. Selling price, 
This Nissan Altima has something nearly impossible to find in a new family sedan, a six-speed manual transmission. This may be a deal-breaker for some shoppers, but will add to the appeal for others. A manual can also help you avoid the expensive repairs sometimes necessary with aging automatics. On the other hand, this Altima still has its original clutch after 186,500 miles. That could also be a costly repair when it finally wears out, which could be at any time. Beyond that issue, the brakes might need attention. Otherwise, the car is said to run well and has a working sunroof. Longevity, inexpensive parts, and affordable repair costs made the Ford Crown Victoria a favorite of police departments, taxi companies, and other fleet operators for years. With 255,000 miles showing on the odometer, this one could have plenty of life left. The seller says it runs well in spite of a noisy alternator, and that it was a daily driver until being recently replaced with another car. For $750, it could be yours, with black paint, stealthy look, and all. A limited budget doesn't mean you can't find an SUV. It might just mean you have to dig a little deeper into the ads. This 2000 Chevrolet Blazer has traveled 220,000 miles, but looks to be in decent shape for its age with no evidence of dents or obvious rust. The ad says it runs well, with no engine or transmission issues. The tires are said to be nearly new, but the owner admits it needs a new battery and that the front end is in need of attention. This vehicle is proof that even a pickup truck can still be had for less than $1,000. The seller claims this Ford Ranger XLT extended cab pickup is a dependable truck that runs and drives well. It's equipped with a six-cylinder engine, a five-speed manual transmission, and four-wheel drive. The ad makes no mention of mileage, but this Ranger could make a good work truck with few frills. Fewer amenities might mean less comfort, but it also means fewer parts that need to be repaired or replaced. Said to have been the daily driver of a family with four kids, the seller admits the interior of this town and country minivan will need a deep cleaning, with DEEP in capital letters. This issue, as well as some rust, are factors that have led to an asking price below market value. The good news is the van has recently had exhaust work and new tires added, and the owner says it runs well enough to take a cross-country trip tomorrow. Described as a family car that was passed down to the current owner, this Buick Century has racked up 269,000 miles but is said to run well, with no engine or transmission issues. It looks to be in decent overall condition, and the owner says the interior is clean and that the tires are good, but there is a power steering hose leak. Fortunately, that should be a relatively inexpensive fix. According to the ad, the Century has been replaced with a new car from a dealership, but that the trade-in offer was too low. Instead, the owner would rather see it go to someone in need of basic transportation, and, it seems, for a few more dollars than the dealership was offering. 